Welcome, people and block roomians, yes, to some news. And today I'm talking about weird news, actually, for this channel. Game development news. Now, before you think, oh, God, go away, eh, it's all right. Uh, you can stay along if you want. Um, but what you're seeing on the screen now, anyway, is Unreal Engine 4 in action. Basically, what Re Unreal Engine 4 is, is basically a game engine in which you can kind of make games. It's not as simple as just plopping in a sofa or a bed like that and then there you go, there's your scene. You've actually generally still got to make it. It's just kind of the thing in which you make the game on. So, I think, I'm pretty sure Bioshock Infinite, that was made on Unreal Engine, and quite a lot of other games. I mean, it's a pretty powerful engine. Now, the reason why I'm talking about this is because today, it's free. Yes, Unreal Engine 4 and all future updates will be free for everyone. Not just for developers, not for people who have earned over a certain amount. It'll be free for everyone. So seriously, there's no reason that if you've ever thought of making a game, there's no reason to not go on and ha have a little download and just play around with it. Because to us, I barely know what I'm doing. I mean, I've been using Unity now for a little bit just because that was free when I was using it. And I've kind of got a bit of the basics. I'm doing a bit on that. And also today, there was a Unity kind of like conference thingy. It just popped up on my Twitter, so I checked it out. And apparently Unity 5 um, is also going to be free. I mean, it's going to have a couple of less features. However, the, I think it's going to be fully pro. It's just over a certain amount. You you don't get like... Oh, it, it's something like that. I don't, I don't know the exact things. It's just... It's amazing because I've always wanted to try out this. And look at this. Play me now. But, um, however, there is a slight little catch, and this isn't really a big catch if you just want to mess around with it, trust me. It's no catch if you want to mess around with it, because you probably most likely wouldn't get to this stage if you're just messing around. But, um, basically, when you release your application or your game that you make, the same instance this was a game, bear in mind not all games will look like this, because obviously the person's had to make the game, they've had to do everything. Um, and also the gameplay wouldn't look like this when it's got gameplay in it because then that will also go on to the gameplay load itself and then also slow it down a bit more as well as all the graphics, whatever. So whenever you release your game, which you can do, you have to pay a 5% royalty on your revenue of the game after the first $3,000 on that product in that quarter. Now this may sound confusing, so I'm going to break it down a little bit on what I'm pretty sure it means. So, in a quarter, so usually, I'm, well, I mean, guessing by the word quarter, and I'm pretty sure it is as well, because I'm about it for some GTA 5 update once. Um, there's four quarters to the year, obviously there's winter, spring, summer, autumn. Uh, so what I'm guessing it means is if, in say for instance, you release the game, I uh, know, the game... I don't know, Dalek's Revenge, copyright to uh, BBC, whatever. So say for instance you make that, and then that sells $3,000 in winter, or like in its first quarter of release, say for instance it was released in December, then I don't know, three, yeah, three months later, it happens to have made $3,000 or more, then you would have to pay 5% royalty on each one, which basically means you just get 5% less the profit. Which, when you think about it, isn't that bad of a deal, because you're now giving you a free engine, a free chance to be able to make whatever you want, and, oh, brilliant. It's brilliant. So, I know, as I said, not a lot of you would be maybe interested in this, but just in case you've ever thought, you know what, I fancy making a little bit of a game, then you can have a little bit of mess around, because someone like me has actually sort of managed to make a game. It's not a full managed game. Look at this, though! Fucking no, not, not, not saying you won't be able to make this, because obviously this is super professional work and professional graphics designers and professional modelers at work. Uh, not saying that you can't, I mean, you, there's by any chance you might be the next Rockstar Games, you never know. But um, idea of the games actually that do come out in Epic, since this is made by Epic, a real uh, development engine, so employing the latest uh, popular game engine, this, Includes Street Fighter V, Fable Legends, and I Valkyrie. So, if you want an idea of what this engine can do, you can have a look at them. And also, bear in mind, if you've paid for UE4 subscription, that's basically what you had to do before they made it free, 
uh, you will receive $30 to spend uh, in the Unreal Engine Marketplace, which I, if there's anything like the Unity one, it's just where you get like your assets from. I mean, you can make them or you can pay for them. Or you can just hire a graphics designer and get him to make everything while slaughtering him with coffee every five seconds. So, <laughs> oh dear. No, I, I would be brilliant in charge of a game studio. Work harder, no sleep, drink your coffee, get working, and then just sit there with my pile of cash next to me. I, I would be like a good representative for EA, wouldn't I? Work harder, release, we must get it out before Christmas. And then just sitting there with a massive mound of cash. No? Okay. But anyway, if you enjoyed the sound of that, or have ever thought, you know what, I'd like to make a game, go ahead and go download it. I mean, it's free, you might as well. I mean, there's Unity 5 now, which is also free. So, go ahead and play that. Of course, there are a few things, which I'm not too sure what exactly they are. Of course, you'll have to check that out. But anyway, thank you for watching, have fun, and cheerio.